What's the All right. Violator, it's your boy Super Saiyan Job. We with my, 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 my man, the infamous Kenny. You might have known him from them viral videos, them ketchup and mustard videos. Yeah, the ketchup and mustard. So let me ask you, man, yo, where did you, where did that come from? This started almost 30 years ago when I was a youngin', okay. and it was a, a game with my, me and my brother where he'd, I'd hold my arm out and he'd try to ricochet the ketchup off the burger to get nothing on me but everything on the burger. Right. And, you know, then it became like height and distance, let's see how far I can shoot it and still get on. And then it was also some ancillary damage, and it just got worse and worse and worse, and 30 years later, it's what you're going to see shortly. Oh, history, baby. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. And then you, you hear that, 30 years later, it's still popping. We got ESPN coming. Everybody checking for this man right here. Oh, man, you guys are on it, dog. Oh, we we love it. Hey, we come from the ATL. Hey. I, I was born and raised up here. The military brought me to the South. My wife got me there. Having trouble snow ever since. Nice. We come back to our Bills games, baby. Right. Right. Got to get yes, the track, bro. Bills, Bills hey. ball the ball over here. You know. Like I said, man, we violate sports. Definitely look at some on YouTube. Oh, yeah. I'm going to take a picture of your shirt, man. Oh, yeah. Thank so you. I remember, I, I'm an old man. I don't have the memory I used to have. <laughs> I hear that. We're just trying to build our subscribers. We get about yeah. 200 views a video. All right. Yeah, all right. All right. It'd be an honor, brother. It'd be an honor. I'm, I'm super saying, Jaffy, this cool guy, J.D. He cool. Yes, sir. Like yes, see, y'all don't see the other side of this. Cool like grass in the winter. Oh, watch out. <laughs> oh, see what you... <laughs> So you already know, Super Saiyan job, you might let's work with some real Bills fans. We had it all day. All right, so man, we've been another Bills fan. Die hard, I love it. What's your name, brother? Captain Buffalo. Captain, Captain Buffalo, Buffalo, you already Buffalo. know. Yeah, we violated a sports man, so let me ask you, man, how long you been a Bills fan? Oh, God knows. I didn't. When I woke up, I was a Bills fan. Since then, non stop. I'm not going to lie, man. I feel I'm the same way. I'm not. So, what's going to happen tonight? Oh, this is going to be a fun one. Everybody's thinking that whole Indianapolis shutout, that nonsense, all that stuff that happened. It's going to surprise them. Yep. So what I'm saying, man. Get a nice little surprise tonight. See that video, Tom Brady? You calling Bills Mafia out, man? Oh, I do not like that. Uh, yeah, I ain't like I do that. Not like that. <laughs> you know, just, you go do your thing, and we'll do our thing. But I do know. All right, what up, everybody? Top to top, it's your boy Jay Super Saiyan Jaffe. What's going on, cool guy JD on the IG? We violated sports. We got a different type of an episode going. This was our vlog episode. The vlog episode, the tailgate. With which I will say was a success. You feel me? I definitely agree. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, today we took a trip out to Orchard Park. We got to meet some great people. You know, Diehards. Diehard Bills fans. It was like being home. It was like being home, Violators. Uh, we uh, went to the Hammers lot. We got to talk to my boy, Kenny. Uh, you might know him as he's a diehard Bills fan, the one that gets the ketchup and mustard poured on him. Before uh before the game before kick before home games, that was dope. We got to talk to uh, man. We talked to so many people, bro. So many people. Uh, we gonna show y'all those too. It's good. Now we in this Monday night game, trying to see what's good. Uh, so far into the game, uh, the Bills, the defense. It looks. I don't want to talk too much. It says the Patriots, but the defense looks like they're able to hold their own. Matt Milano shooting through gaps, killing it. You know, right now. The energy, uh, I definitely think the Bills feel the energy. That was all that energy we felt out there today at that tailgate. That the Bills are playing like it. Um, it's crazy because it's gonna be a good one. I mean, like I say all the time, you know, the Bills is like every other game type of team, and right now they're playing like it's that game that they're gonna show like that that good side. And honestly, bro, the piggyback that's that's what happens when you get a. A prime time game, the first time in ten years. I mean, you know? that's true. You, you, that's you true. got Bills Mafia out there. It's, it's electric out there. Uh, Till and Moan, they at the game. Me and Jew, we could have went to the game. We decided to to uh, to, to you know give you guys a different uh, format of the show. Yeah, I mean the show must go on at the end of the day. Um, and right now, I mean it was a great uh, week of NFL football. But like we said before, only thing that matters right now. Is the Bills versus the Pats? Oh yeah, this is what we've been waiting for. This this is this is what we've been trolling for the last the last seven weeks. Yeah, you this is brother? what we've been set up for. Everybody knows. Mm-hmm. Yeah, everybody knows. You know, if we if the Bills take a if the Bills take this W tonight, I'm gonna have to come next week fully. Come come what though? Come next show, I'm coming completely Bills. 
down from head to toe. You wearing an Eric Moe's jersey 2003, 2003 days backwards. Listen, I don't care what it is. All right, we, we back into this one. Let's go. Brady to James White. I'm conf- I don't know. I'm, I'm not. I'm trying to understand why uh, Gaines is out there. Is he a is he a nickel cornerback or is he on the outside? You know, I haven't seen him out there. Let me see. All right, there you go. There you go. Yeah, he on the outside. Let's see. Let's see. Bam, Edelman. Ah, oh, there we go. See, this is the Bills. We rolling. See, this, this, we this, rolling. This is the pay. This is how the Patriots play you. This and this, is, this is how they kill you. It's about to get real good out here. I try to tell you. Um, you know, it's crazy. You know, just being in that heart. Oh, that there's nothing like that Bills tailgate. I tell you that there's. I'm listening, bro. I'm this. <laughs> there's nothing like it. You know, all the fans, just diehard. You got people that's been going there for longer than we've been alive. Oh yeah, we talked you to a know. couple fans. They, they said they've been uh, fans since '85, '69. Like we talked to a lot of interesting people. You it, know, it was that, it was definitely a. a a successful day, I'd say. You know? you know, and then you got Patriots fans too that drove nine hours straight just to get to this game, and you know it was just an awesome time. And there we go, James White touchdown machine. Damn. And see, this, 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 and this is what I'm talking about. This is what I've been talking about, like week in and week out. Nobody can find a formula to stop the Patriots. You know what? Like their offense isn't anything special. They, they're very, they're, they have, they're a very talented group of uh, guys. Oh, oh, come on, come on, yeah, Tremaine, was, that was you, that was you, boy. Yeah, Tremaine is something serious, man. We got to give that man his props. He's a freak of nature. He and is. he's only 20, 20, 20 years old. 20 years old. He was old. 19 when he got drafted. Mm, he, he, you see that? Yeah. Over, he jumped he too soon. He could jump, he could jump. But he jumped too soon. That would have been an INT if he if he um timed that jump right. Yeah, it's all right. I ain't mad at him. <laughs> Tom Brady does throw interceptions in Buffalo. The games he's lost in Buffalo has. There we go. Hey, what's this? I thought Josh Gordon was supposed to be benched for for disciplinary reasons. Listen, why why the, he out there? When, when the Bills come out playing like they was playing, forget disciplinary that, reasons. That open the defense. Yes, we need him. I mean, but damn, like. Eh. He shouldn't the coach he should, The coach should stick to his word Man have some respect some Yeah but it's respect. all about a win This is a divisional game here We yeah, can't but, lose But you, but you gotta we set a tone for the team He listen. just talked about Holding everybody accountable But then he's in on a, the second series That's what crazy What type of tone is it gonna be If we lose to the Buffalo Bills On Monday night Come on oh, We got my. trick plays too Damn Brady just got blasted Wow But Tom Brady really just laid that block he, Tom Brady sprung him for that first down He really did Who was that Edelman? Yes. <laughs> wow. Lorenzo Alex, you don't let Tom Brady unathletic self the little clog bang. you up. You don't damn. <laughs> <laughs> That's all good. <laughs> little, 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 little. Hey, take one for the team. Take one for the team. Come on, he's up. Hey. A... He caught that? Incomplete. Okay. Okay. I didn't know what that was. And, and, but see, that's that's the way Tom Brady plays. When you when you're getting consistent pressure on on Cry, um, I mean Brady, that's what that's what happens. You know, right. you know, you took a picture with Cry Baby. I, I did. You and violators, you gonna see that. And you gonna see that in the show. <laughs> you gonna see that. Yeah, it was but a man, lot of uh, pictures got took today. It was nice. A lot of video. A lot of networking. A lot of uh, reaching out to people. It was it was cool. It was a good event. I, I enjoyed it. Let's go, Damn. let's go, let's go. Let's go get out of bounds. <laughs> Man, that's the Bills, Save yourself. See, the Bills defense not disciplined. No, it's not that it was disciplined. No, it's not disciplined. Look, you, said, you saw that. Uh, that was a defensive breakdown. Look at this. It was a good play action. Look at that. It wasn't a defensive. That's what happens. I mean, it was a little dish out to the running back. They was, they, they're was they after Brady's head. But the problem is, is that you could get after Brady's head, but shoot, we going to get you underneath. That's true. That's true. I'm just I'm waiting for. Uh, I think Shaq Lawson is gonna have a day to that, a night. Shaq I mean, Lawson has been putting in work. Um, the way I look at it, this? the way I look at it, if we could stop Khalil Mack, we could damn sure stop. 
Shaq lost him. That's no, oh, that's a fact. That's not even in, that's not even in question. I'm just saying, but I, I like our pass rush. Again, in this game, our pass rush is definitely something we got going for us. Um, you see, Matt Milano, he 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 jumping through gaps like a bat out of hell. Matt Milano, Matt Milano, and uh, Edmonds. Edmonds is like them. Those two in white got to be my two favorite people on the Bills defense. I love Alexander too, though. You, you, you said it, uh, White, uh, Tredavious White. He's been like all season. He's been shadowing the um, team's number ones, and he's been he's been a top. I would say a top five cornerback right now. I will agree. I will agree. I mean, and honestly, it comes a time where you know you got certain lockdown corners: Champ Bailey, Darrell Revis, Deion Sanders, Akeem Talib. You know, you got. Would you throw Patrick Peterson in there? Hell yeah! Well, he he's only made the Pro Bowl every year since rookie year. Yeah, yeah. I, I honestly, I just don't think he gets talk, talked about just because of the team he plays for. I, I heard that he was. Uh, he wanted to trade. He wanted to trade, but then I heard he wants to stay. So, but you know how it is. The trade deadline on the thirtieth. It's all type of room. The rumor mill was just is rolling. Oh yeah. You know how that go. I mean, I heard a rumor that the Patriots were trying to get OBJ. Nah, that'll never happen. Who knows what would happen? Nah, Giants. I don't see Giants. I don't. It's not even that I don't see. It. I know the Giants ain't letting OBJ. Ain't letting OBJ go. If that happens. It's terrifying. They also trying to get uh, Denarius Thomas too. I saw that too. That'd I, I saw a rumor that we're trying to. We're looking into Denarius Thomas as well. Y'all need him. How does he look? Thirty? Or he might be thirty-two. I think he's thirty-two. I don't think he's that old. Nah, I think he's like thirty. I think. Uh, I don't think he's that old, bro. I think he's 32, bro. I'm going to look it up right now. I don't think he's that old because you got to think, I mean, when was Tebow in there? I'm about to tell you right now. 2012, maybe? 2011? Tebow, I couldn't even tell. I don't even want to. I really don't know. Demarius is? Oh, he's 30 years old. 30 years old. See, okay. that's not that bad. He's still got some football in this wide receiver. It's not like it's a running back. Yeah, but he ain't, I mean, even if he, even if we somehow were to get him in here, I mean, with our quarterback situation, how do you, how do you expect him to eat the way he eats, the way he's used to eating at least? I mean, listen, the man ate with me when he had Tim Tebow. Nah, he 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 didn't become the the, the name he is now until. Nah, he was making all the plays. Go get that! Go get that! There we go. For those who don't know, Tom Brady just fumbled the ball, but it's a flag on the play, so that could have been a free play for the Patriots. We don't know. Well, you know when you play the Patriots, all flags are on the opposite team. Now, that's just a fact. So, I I assume this is on Buffalo. Oh. Whoa. whoa. Scooby-Doo. Okay. Was it a false start? False start. Oh, a legal formation. You heard about that uh, one that one uh, field referee getting fired? Yeah, I heard about that. That was crazy. Uh, he put a lot. Uh, that scared a lot of referees. Oh yeah, that's the thing. Honestly, they had they, they had to make an example of him. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's facts. Shoot, uh, Todd Haley and Hugh Jackson got fired today too. Oh, that's another thing. I'm happy you mentioned that. I called that. I, I said Todd Haley would be the interim head coach, so I didn't. I messed that up. But I said Hugh, uh, Hugh Jackson was going to get fired. I don't. I didn't. You don't. You didn't think so. I don't. Oof. Oh. Get out of there. Woo! Okay, Matt. Yo, Matt. Matt Milano was. Yo, he showed up this year. I take that. Three points by the Patriots. I take that. I take that. Let's take a look at this. Breakdown. Oh, come on. You got to get physical with Gronk. That's what, yo, Matt Milano. That was a, that he was, was a draft. He was a draft that was still. A pick. It should have been. It should have been. He it if it just should have been, but he didn't catch it. They going? Okay, they kicking it? Yeah. Of course they kicking it. We violated sports. We got some good old fashioned Bills fans here. Come on. Come on, let's get it. Yo, so, we, like I said, we just walk around here and start talking to everybody, man. We want to know. When you become a Bills fan, I, I like, I'm pulling the, the fireman hats, man. That's what's up. That's fine, oh, man. Yeah. We're actually from Dayton, Ohio. Okay. And we became Bills fans in the 80s, back when, well, I, I'm the older brother. So, um, being from Ohio, you know, we got the Bengals and Browns, but the Bills, I mean, 
Bills in the 80s, they were the team, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah the fans. Um, so we just became um, fans of the, well, my favorite player was Bruce Smith. And I got into football and I became a defensive lineman. Me too. Defensive end. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. So, um, you know, I adopted 78 as my football number. And here we go. And it just, we never jumped off the bandwagon. Then after we got out of high school, we came here as brothers for the first time. And we come back every year. That's dope. I just noticed he got the Thurman. Yeah, me growing up, I wanted to be like my, my older brother here. I just... I always looked up to him and kind of jumped on the bandwagon with him. As Thurman was my idol. I've had. You excited had, they retired his jersey tonight? I had 34 in every sport I played from third grade to college. Oh, man. And baseball, yeah. football. I got a tattoo on my chest. Hey. That's my man. He's my idol. He's him a bad and, man. Him and Michael Jordan are the two best athletes ever. Oh, yeah. Thurman Thomas, the best hands out the back yep. ever. Yep, he's my favorite. So. And that's the thing. Thurman Thomas slept on. He is a, what, a 91 MVP? That was 91? Yeah, so I already know, man. Violator Sports, we're talking to everybody. We're talking to the, the top Bills fans we see. You already know how it is. Top to top, we all want. Oh, yeah. Look at, look, at look at that. Look at that going, man. Look at Violators. Look at that going. Oh, oh that's hey, the that's far off the bone. Yeah. Chicken off the bone. Yeah. This is what you get in the Bills country, Thank Violators. You. you already know. Yeah. And I'm Super Saiyan Jaffe, top to top. Violators first with my man, Jonathan. Once again, another Bills fan. You already know what it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, it's all good. I'm feeling the get up, man. It's nice. You like it? I, 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 I love it. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> so what's going on? What are we doing this Monday night football game? Tonight what we're doing, uh, we're going to meet the Patriots, obviously. Go lead, brother. Yeah. All right. Statistically, yeah. the Bills are going to beat the Patriots. Okay. Well, people right. forget. Well, people forget. I know Tom Brady playing. Like, people forget the last time we played the Patriots. Who? And Tom, uh, people, like, you know, fans. Um, who's playing? Tom Brady. Who's that? Tom, oh, Tom Crybaby. Oh, Sorry. he's going to break his leg tonight. Sorry. I mean, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you see the rain coming out? Hey, man. Bill's Mafia. We here. Yo, let me ask you real quick, man. How did you become a Bill's fan? Fucking rain and pussy. Exactly. I think I was Bill's born a Bill's fan, fan, obviously, but. Hell yeah. That's the answer you got to have. Fucking right. The same way, baby. <laughs> yeah. See, I've been a fan since the dark ages. See, my man. You see this? Get that, man. The bacon. Man. Hey. So my man, cool guy JD behind the camera. My man Jonathan, Bills Mafia, Violator Sports. We out, baby. We we got to see a lot. We got to meet a lot of people. It was interesting, man. Like I said, we we uh we hung out yeah. with the uh, firefighters. I, I definitely think they were the coolest. Oh, definitely. I mean, that's where we that's where we camped out. You know, that's where we decided put a song to, to a lot of cool music. You know what I mean? And they from Ohio. You know what I mean? Like they drive up to every. Uh, was it a uh, real Ohio? Huh? Real high, right? Yeah. Yeah. They drive up to every game, so that's something special. Like, you and, know. And, and bro, I will say one thing for sure. I will say, if you go violators, if you go tailgate, tailgate at Hammer's Lot, the uh, the Campers Lot, RV Lot, that's cool. But Hammer's Lot, oh yeah, I don't know. It, it, it's I like that natural, organic feel, man. Everybody just out, man, drinking, turned oh, yeah. up, partying, man. Oh yeah, it's love. It's it's love out there. So many zubas. A lot of Zumbas, a lot of Zumbas, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of Thurman Thomas jerseys. By the way, my boy Thurman get a, his jersey retired tonight. Congratulations to him. That thirty four, definitely put in work. Wow. Obviously the Bills, between him and uh, OJ, Bills best running backs in history. I can't debate that. I can't debate that. And, and the thing is, I'm not even. I'm gonna give Thurman enough respect. I'm not even gonna go. I'm not. I'm not gonna leave him up by saying OJ is, but I'm gonna say literally. It's either Thurman or OJ. It's literally your preference between the two. Honestly, I was. I'm honestly. I'm putting Thurman over OJ because I'm thought OJ that. didn't want to be here. Really? He did not want to be here. That's why when OJ went and played for the 49ers and everything else, he wanted to get traded back to the West Coast. OJ did not want to be in Buffalo. I I couldn't say. If you I can't think say about it. That. Yeah, OJ did not want to be here. Um, Thurman Thomas lives here. Still, I've met Thurman Thomas a few times. He's a he's a cool cat. Him and his wife, his family got a beautiful family. So he he this is this is well deserved. He he deserved this. I mean, there's some Bills players that just play for the team and just stay here. I mean, Jim Kelly. See, that's going back to them '90s Bills, man. Those, those '90s Bills, that was a that was a brotherhood. That was a family. Yeah, that's there's a lot of fans out there. 
that's been fans from the 90s and then you got fans that was from the 80s you know that's another thing with, with, the, with the firefighters you know they said they was die hard since the 80s 85 you know and the crazy no i don't think it was 85 i think it was right, longer than that said um the uh the one the i forget his name the younger brother he said he was a fan since 85 oh but the, i was talking about the older brother oh he, yeah. yeah and he was a fan because of his brother because of his older brother and that's understandable because, you know, that's how it is when you're brothers. Oh, but, um, I, I, you know how many fans we talked to today that you asked them, like, how did you become a Bills fan? Yeah. I was born that way. That's just the same with me. I can't. I was just born a Bills fan. I guess I wasn't born that way. The funniest thing, though, <laughs> is, like, the craziest thing is that we spoke to so many people that wasn't from here. I noticed that, and Hammer's like it was a lot of it was a lot of people that's that's getting on the road tomorrow morning or tonight. Like like we, we saw that uh, and Hammer's like we saw that camper. Was it like South Carolina? Yeah, we saw those Bills fans we met from Los Angeles. Yeah, the it the was, Patriots fan yeah. was the wife. Yeah. Bills fan was the husband. That was a beautiful thing. That was a real beautiful thing. All right, man. But all in all, today was a successful day. What, what would you say? Uh, you know what? It was a successful day. I mean, honestly, we got out there. We met a lot of people that we needed to meet. I mean, like I said, we met Kenny, Captain Buffalo. You know what I mean? It was a lot of good time. It was a good experience, and it was like warming out there. And what I like the most is we got we we got we had the opportunity to 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 spread our name, spread the Violator brand. Exactly. And, and a lot of people were interested in what we had to talk about. A lot of people were we uh. Got a few subs off of it. Oh, yeah. Our views spiked a little bit. Oh, yeah. So that's always good. You can't be mad at that. And I will say at halftime, man, the game, is it's not over like everybody thought. Everybody, we not packing it in yet. Patriots up nine, Bills three. Yeah, but we, we get the ball in the second half. The pass is a second half team, so they we got to remember that. You saw how Tom Brady just carved up the defense in that minute and 50 seconds that they just had. Oh, yeah, and he was studying on the iPad, so you know we got something to store. Yeah, I will say the Patriots and Belichick, they're the king of uh, second-half adjustments. Oh, yeah, hands down. They come out to a complete different team. The only way the Bills is going to be successful if they keep that same energy that they came out with. I mean, but, you know, like I say all the time, it's not about how you start the game. It's about how you finish it. Big facts, big facts. But Violators, man, we happy y'all on this journey with us. Y'all tuning in with us week in and week out. We going to always make sure we're trying to bring you the best content out there. Me, my man, cool guy, my man, Till and Mo. You know, we going to always, we going to always, we gonna, we're trying to stay fresh. We're trying to have something different. Oh, yeah. We, just, we hope you enjoy it. And, you know, next week is going to be back to the regular schedule program. Like I said, this game right here, we're going to break down the rest next week. But this, I mean, honestly, when it comes down to it, this is one of the most exciting games, even though it don't mean a thing. You know what I mean? Because we oh, already know who's going to win. Why it don't mean a thing? Because you already know who's going to win. I mean, but, bro, look at the score is 9-3. Is, is For do, now. Do the Patriots, but, For bro, now. Just listen. But do the Patriots put up nine points and a half? Uh, at the beginning of the season, yeah. Well, now I'm talking about now. I'm talking about when they're when they're a well oiled machine. Listen, you guys got a good defense. We gonna see how many points we have next t- two quarters. We That's still got a whole another half a game. It's gonna be a whole brand new game <laughs> co- coming to the end of this thing. So, I right, know. So I will say, man, thanks for tuning in with us. Yeah, Once thanks again. I'm Super Saiyan Jaffe, cool guy JD. Thanks for everybody commenting. Uh, the shout outs, we feeling the love. We're going to continue to grow. Thanks for all of the sub- subs. Keep on like, share, and comment. Yeah, make sure you follow us on Instagram at Violator Sports. Make sure you like us on Facebook, same name, Violator Sports. Keep commenting on us. Keep commenting on our uh, YouTube channel. Like I said, we're just trying to bring a different a different feel for us with the sports world. And stay tuned for the Violator podcast because that's coming real soon for you. That's something we want for the ladies. Yeah. Violator's hoodies coming soon too. Mm-hmm. Place your order. Get it in now. Because that first set is probably going like hotcakes. So just let us know. Reach out. That's a fact. Let us know those sizes in the comments and the DMs on Instagram and Facebook. And we're going to make it happen. Like I said, at the end of the day, man, we violators is what we do. Violator sports, man. We out. Yeah. See, you never know we're going to get out here.